Hello, in this video we will discuss two more switch operations. First one is frame switching, second one is frame flooding. So what is frame switching? So guys, whenever a switch will receive a frame, let's say this is a switch and it is receiving some frame. So how it will forward the frame? So to forward the frame, in the frame there will be two MAC addresses, one will be source and other will be destination. So it will check destination MAC address in its table in its MAC address table and to the port to which that particular MAC address is connected to that particular port device will send the information. So like you can see here this computer is generating information source MAC is A destination is B so when switch will receive that particular frame switch will check its MAC address table and switch knows that yes B connected to which port port number 2 so switch will forward the information to port number 2. So frame switching is basically defining how switch forward frames. Now, so frame flooding means whenever switch will receive a frame, it will check destination MAC address in the MAC address table. But let's assume that destination MAC address is not present in MAC address table. So what will happen? Switch will broadcast that particular frame out of all the ports except the received one. Like you can see in this case, we have to wait for the GAF. So let's say this guy is sending a frame, source MAC is A, destination is B. Switch receives the frame. So first thing is switch will add the MAC address in its table. We can see an entry here. But now destination MAC B is not present in the table. So what switch will do, it will forward it to all the users to B also and C also. The same concept is called unknown unicast flooding. So guys, this is the concept of frame flooding. In this video, we have understood two different operation on switches. First is frame switching, second is frame flooding. Thank you.